Super K. We were getting requests from people for something different. Obviously got sick of catching all those fish on the T1, I don't know. But no signs of the T1 abating in its effectiveness. However, people had been out for two, three years and people wanted to see something different from us. We were getting requests from people. Did we do anything else? They were trying to pre-bake somewhere and people were getting in on what they were using. Uh, so, you know, we've eventually established a need for another product, okay? And here's the Super K. It's made on exactly the same base mix as the T1. So all that authenticity, that authentic food signal, all the natural attractors that we've got in there, in the right quantities are still there. However, we've gone down a completely different route with this one on the, on the liquid side, and that's, we've created a very sort of pungent, spicy, meaty type aroma. It's different from pretty much anything else I've ever seen. Um, there aren't many good meat-based baits out there and this fills a gap in the market, it's different. I don't think personally it's as instant as the T1, but that doesn't mean it won't catch from the off, okay? The T1's in a league of its own in terms of instant attractiveness, but the, the main difference with this is, it's something that they can take a little time to get, and it's a kind of an acquired taste if you understand what I mean, but once they're on it, this, this is the important thing, once they've seen a bit of it, they become absolute mugs for it. And you watch them just demolishing big beds of it in the margins. And again, once they've seen enough of it, can't emphasize this enough, they become daft. They become very, very catchable. And it's something that they easily recognize then as something they want to get down on and get finished as soon as possible. And again, results speak for themselves. It's one that's a creeper but has delivered some outstanding results. I mean, I've now had 11 UK 40s, okay? Eight different ones, I've had repeated on a couple of them, but this for me was, the power of the K was demonstrated on, on, on Savay Lake, when once we got a little bit in, they became very, very easy to catch. And my mate Craig, I think he, had, he finished on 20 fish last season. It was my first year on Syndicate, I finished on 10. So it's a very, very potent, very effective fish catching product. May need, a, may need a little bit of introduction. So in our range, if I had to pick a campaign bait, which was something that's a little bit different, it's not as obvious that not everyone's going to be using, and I wanted to feed it in quantity, then this would be the product I'd choose, okay? It's, it's a campaign bait, it's a big fish bait, and it, seems, it appears to be more big fish selective. I was just gonna say, out of the 11 UK 40 pound captures I've had, five of them have been on this, okay? It does seem to be slightly more big fish selective. So if you're an out and out, hardcore, on the scene, big fish angler, and you want a campaign bait, this is it. It does it everywhere. Manor, Save, you name it, wherever it's been used, it's done biggins and it's done loads of biggins. So again, hardcore product for a hardcore big fish community.